Shaver Arbiter to the outside gate. They're all in. And away they go. Wrong turn Cupid from the inside gate as fast. Careless Star goes with her. Those two fly early. Wish they all could be as the grey. On the far side, Shavera Arbiter is in the four spot. Down at the rail, shut it out. Is now six lengths off those leaders who are flying. The rain song in the stripes racing alongside of that. Then we come back to Jasmine Chieftain and flat out Joy is now last. The end of the turn they go, wrong turn, Cupid at the rail and careless star. Absolutely nose and hose and they clear by three and a half. Wish they all could be now coming after them from third. A big gap of five backs to shout it out. They come into the top of the lane and careless star, but now wish they all could be burst forth and wish they all could be. The grey is now coming at careless star. They are stride for stride with an eighth to go. Coming on late, the rain song down the centre. Center, we have Jasmine Chieftain, but it is Wish They All Could Be taking the lead and striding away. Wish They All Could Be gives another one to Antonia Freysu. They win it easily. Flat out Joy will get up for second. In behind that came Jasmine Chieftain. The unofficial result, winner number five, wish they could all be. Second number three, flat out joy. Third number seven, Jasmine Chieftain. Fourth was number two, Careless Star. Result is official. In the sixth race today, number one, Brother Reed, please delete that equipment change at the bottom of the page. Now in the winner's circle, number five, wish they all could be.
She's a five-year-old grey mare by Grayson out of Chiello Dolce. She's owned by Mike Bello and Bartlett. Winning trainer is Doug O'Neill, whose assistant is Leandro Mora. The winning rider, Antonio Fresu, he gets his second win today. The winner was Brittany California by Stormy Hull.